Hello trendsetters, I'm back again, smoking pipes house style, with another box opening, hopefully this will be another Kiko pipe, still sealed, eBay, Extreme Ops, box opening knife, for opening box when they're extreme, ooh, which side to open, top or the bottom, let's open the bottom, Remember yesterday we got that one. Whoa. Take that little graphic out. I got that yesterday. Whoa, wee, big Kiko, 102 billion. Rusticated. Mission line, saddle bit. Let's see what this one is. Open that box up. Bubble wrap. Wee. Bubble wrap. We love bubbles. Ooh, and a note. Ooh, invoice. Oh, invoice. Oh, the invoice says. Move the box. Oh, vintage, huge estate tobacco pipe, Mark Kilimanjaro 104 Mearsham Line. <gasps> I see loads of bubble wrap. So let's open the bubble wrap. Whee! Oh. Nah, I'm only joking. Here it is. Ta da! Look at that. The next Kiko pipe. Oh, bubbles at the right. Check that bad boy. That's a rusticated Kiko bent pipe billiard with Meerschaum lined bowl. Let's have a look inside. Let's get the torch. Let's have a look inside this bowl. Don't worry, I haven't even looked inside it yet. Let's get that torch in there. Can we? Can we do it? Can we get some light in there? Look at that one. Oh. No, we don't want that. There we go. See in there? Check that out. There we go. Cooking of gas. Look how clean that is. Pipe made in the 60s. Nice, clean, Meerschaum line bowl. How nice is that? Cool. Wow, that is bigger than this one from yesterday. Look at that. That's the straight billy that I got yesterday. Kiko Pipe, 102. If I line the top, so look at that, look how big they are. That bent pipe is way bigger. That is a bigger pipe. That is really, that is big. I didn't realize how big that one was. And check out that nice bent saddle bit. There's the rhinoceros. That's actually really good, that one. Let's see if we can get some focus on that. Get some focus. There we go, get some focus. Really nice rhinoceros, that one. Really good condition. How's that for a nice rusticated billy pipe from the 1960s made in Africa? Kilimanjaro, it's now Tanzania. They don't make them anymore. Meerschaum lined. Beautiful rusticators. Imported briar, from what I read. Now, someone's really looked after that. This nice saddle bit. This is really good. Check that bad boy out really nice rustication that is a big bent pipe look at that one oh with that same nice old smell i like it's that old smell top of the bowl looks really good around here there we go we get the road get that to focus there come on there we go that's really nice. Very flush, very smooth. So the rim of the rim of the mission is in really good condition. That's really cool. That saddle bit is really nice. And as I was saying yesterday, they just unscrew. Now sometimes when these bits come off these Kiko pipes, they're really tight in here. In there. That can be really tight in there sometimes. And if you shove a screwdriver in there and twist it, that's aluminium, you'll wreck it. So sometimes you just have to live with it. So don't be yanking on it too much. It just threads in there. Now you remember, you're, you're threading into a piece of wood with a bit of aluminium, so steady as she goes. Put it all the way in. Now if we do want to take that bit off and leave that in, 
just need to give it a bit of a it's not coming off so we're gonna leave that one <clears throat> like I said don't force it if they don't want to come out just leave them don't force them you reckon <laughs> someone's polished that up really good someone's really given that a good polish a little bit of oxidation still there but they've polished it up anyway they've given it a real good go couple of teeth marks in it, not bad. On the bottom it says 104 Kilimanjaro made in Tanganyika, which is now Tanzania. The mansion was mined in Tanganyika, or Tanzania as we call it now. And that is big. How big is that bowl compared to that one? It's a bigger bowl than the one I got yesterday. Check that out. That's them head to head. Wow. It didn't look that big on the pictures on eBay when I got it, but that looks awesome. Why do I get these? I dig them. They're really cool. I like the, I like the, the history behind it. They're made in the 60s, made in Africa, before the state was Tanzania. The mission was, lined, was mined in Africa. It's imported bry, from what I've been told. I really like the saddle bit. I like the design. I like the rustication. They're really cool. I've had one of these before. I remember, it was stolen. They're really good smokers, very dry smokers, and I really dig that saddle bit. Look at that. Basically, that one needs to be polished up. This is the one we got today, and it's come off eBay as well. Damn. Bite down, I don't make them like they used to. That came out of Africa. From America, this one, two weeks to get here, one day longer than that one, and I bought on the same day. How cool is that? Two weeks, two weeks in a day. Really dig it. <laughs> really good looking pipe. Really clean bowl. Look at that. Look how clean that is. Hey, eh? for a pipe made in the sixties, I think this has been sitting around for such a long time, doing nothing, and that's how you want to get them. Oh, that is a big bowl. That is really clean. No cake, just that super, super thin sort of black coating you get on there. <laughs> Bottom of the bowl is still white. It goes past the little air hole. That's for any moisture to pool in the bottom and get soaked up. That is a big bowl. That's a big smoker, that one. Oh, I'm going to enjoy smoking. I like these bent ones. Yeah. Now, I thought I told you. Sell the shares. Rascally rabbit. That's a pipe. It's an awesome pipe. Mm, it smells old. I like that smell of old. Look at that. Look at how nice that is. I like them. They're good. I like these pipes. Get on eBay. Have a look. Check them out. See if you like them. There's all types of designs. Leather clad designs. I like these ones. That was the second one of these I've got. The first one was stolen. And I'll, I like it so much I've got another one. This one's actually better than the first one. I'll polish this up later. I really dig it. It's a big, big billiard pipe. This one's a big bed billiard. It's actually bigger than the, that straight one. And I really like this curve. I like the proportions, that big fat shank with the big fat bowl looks really cool. And it's really clean inside. That's a real good pipe. I like that. Off eBay, you got it for a song and a dance. Look how big that is. That's that is that is a big bowl in there. That is huge. That is big. See a lot of tobacco in there. Yeah, that's a big bowl in there. That's a fat bowl. It's really cool. You enjoy smoking this one. Give it a bit of a dust out. I think there's a bit of, a bit of dust in there. And that's, that's in good condition. A couple little teeth marks, but someone's polished it up. Someone's actually cared for it. Um, no damage to the little rhino there. It's got the rhino there too. Some of the paint's come off. Oh, that's the Bent Kiko 
104 from Africa in the 60s. Nearsham line, rusticated billiard, bent billiard. I'm out of here. Ciao.